Hi everyone. Hi everyone. This is Chili Church, is what Hugh Davies calls it. <laughs> and this is our idea. From the 12th of April, coffee shops are allowed to serve outside. So, making use of that allowance, we thought maybe we could gather here around coffee tables. Yeah. Six chairs, you might notice. Mm -hmm. Coffee's not so good right now. In fact, these are just empty, empty. props. But it will be. But we can have cool. nice coffee served cool. from the blue doors, couldn't yeah. we? And then. Um, We've been having youth at fire pits before in the summertime last year and, and back on with that. Back on with um, Kids Church down on the green down there. And we can have some of these coffee tables and going round the back to the crypt as well. Here's the thinking. So, yeah, and so in the mornings in the live stream over the next three weeks, we I am going to be pressing into Genesis 1 to 11. You'll be reading about that in an email as well. So can you see Genesis 1, then Genesis 2 and 3, and then 4 to 11. Some of the most difficult, complex parts of the Bible. We're going to go right in there. There's going to be a Q&R on the fourth Sunday. So those will be three Sunday teachings in a row. Fourth Sunday, Q&R, no taboo subjects, but anything that comes up anything that's raised in those first 11 chapters which we will also thread through to the end of Revelation um, will be here. One of the things we can do is do some discussion around those kind of things so we can engage in the Bible, have absolute confidence that is an inspired word that is critical to speak to us today and there will be other opportunities for spiritual interaction here for prayer and so on but on that fourth Sunday get your questions and responses watch the first three either live stream or through a podcast in the morning get your questions so we can address questions can't answer anything but can respond to those questions so the idea is that Sundays from the 18th of um, April, April mm -hmm. that we could have in the morning we have a, 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 a live stream of worship and teaching and so Alice if we speak she's listened to hundreds of hours of teaching <laughs> material about Genesis and stuff so she's been really getting into the guts of this it's going to be it's going to be really good and then so that's the morning and then in the afternoon potential is for adults to gather around coffee tables groups of six here to chew on that stuff and pray together whilst children can meet at the school or over or, or youth here on site at Hope Chapel so uh, where are you with that? Are you up for being involved? We'd obviously, if we want to do this, we need to have team, yeah. team that can serve coffee and tea, mm. tea t team that can be on kids. Basically, let us know where you're up to and if people are up for it and able to, and we can resource it people-wise, then um, we we'll can start it. meeting in person, yeah. uh, outside, outside, chilly church, every Sunday afternoon. Sunday afternoons. So just to say for those of you who weren't involved in dropping kids off because you either don't have children or they're a different age to, to what was on offer, we had football church going on down there. And it would be something a bit different probably, we'd look for something for younger kids yeah. as well and not, not we'll just We'll do football. the whole range but for, that, for those who can remember it, for those who weren't there, there was a real buzz as people dropped off kids, some people met up and went for walks, some people, I sometimes would talk to people and catch up the whole way through the whole hour. So it's a, to a really easy way for us to all reconnect 4 p.m. on Sunday afternoons. And the goal, of course, is us growing as church, growing as followers of Jesus, and whatever the kind of restrictions are, you know, we grow in different ways. We, we do things in households, and we sense this could be a time when we can get back together around this uh, lovely building. Yep, we need everyone's buy-in. We need people to say, yep, we're up for it. We're up for helping out, getting the team coffee going. Lots of love. We'd love to hear back from you. Cheerio. Bye.